Right, hi folks. Right, so I'm doing these videos kind of sort of remind myself just in case I forget, but I thought I'd share share what I'm doing here on video also, just in case it's of benefit from somebody else and I can practice my video editing skills also. So anyway, in this video we're gonna connect a Sony, which is a kind of sort of like very inexpensive camcorder, a Sony HDR CX240, although on the box it says CX240E, so I guess they're the same thing. So HD Handycam, made by Sony, 9.2 megapixels, so quite small, but I've, this has been a very trusty camera for me, and I started off with this making videos for a couple of YouTube channels, and the YouTube channel that we're on now, Polluted Halo. The camera that we're using here is a Canon EOS M50, which has got the autofocus there, and we've got a Rode mic on top of the camera. So anyway, we don't need to know about that in this particular video. So where are we? Right, so we're gonna connect the, the Sony CX240 to the computer via a cam link. This is not an Elgato cam link. This is a cam link that was uh, picked up of eBay for about seven quid in um, UK pounds which is probably about 10, 11, 12 dollars in US dollars. The main makers of these type of things, like the top brand is Elgato and they do a cam link and they also do a video game capture card also, which I wanna get for connecting up game systems to computers so that you can either live stream or record the screenshots, like with a Nintendo Switch and a PlayStation Portable PSP that we've got also that we want to try out. So we've got the cheapy cam link replica card here, HDMI video capture. So there's there's that. So there's a USB there plugged to go in your socket into the computer and an HDMI in there. So you'll need an HDMI cable of course compatible with whatever device you're using. So this particular HDMI cable has a small HDMI, small end HDMI that goes into the camcorder. And I think that's a micro HDMI, I think. And then the next one's a mini, I think, because I think there's three sizes, but don't quote me on that. And we've got the standard size, which goes into the video capture card here. So let's get going. So I've got a lead here which plugs into the back, USB 3 lead here, which goes into a USB 3 port to the back of the computer. I think this video capture card claims to be USB 3, but I think it's USB 2, so it might be compromised on a few extra features, like 4K maybe, but we're not gonna be messing around with 4K in this video today. So anyway, plug into the USB socket, which like I say goes, this is just extending, this is just an extension cable that goes around the back into just an ordinary USB 3 socket. So that's ready to go. Once you plugged in, usually you get like a message on the computer screen to tell you that it's active, but I plugged this in already today to have a little test run. So all should be good to go. Right, now what we wanna do is open up the side here of the camcorder and go into where the HDMI plug socket is, which will give our signal coming out of the camera. There's Tilly, Tilly the cat. I don't know if you can see her on camera there. You see her tail. Right, so that's switched on. Now we can plug into the video capture card. And we'll just put that over here, facing this way. Now what we want to do is start up OBS Studio, or whatever you've got. I use two, I use OBS Studio and Streamlabs OBS, but at the moment I'm using OBS Studio, because to me it seems a little bit simpler than Streamlabs, but I've got them both there for whenever I do a live stream or whatever. But at the moment I'm just like recording footage from camcorders and other devices and all that type of thing. Anyway, let's get on with it. So um, OBS Studio, so I'll fire that up into the computer. So here we go. Hello Tills, Astro Cat. She, 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 wants, she wants to be on the action, don't you? Hey, you wanna fight, do you? 
You always want to fight me, don't you, eh? So what we've got here on the scene, you can see a camera here, which is the, uh, this is a Logitech 920, C920 camera. So this might get a bit confusing here, but that's kind of set up all the time. So um, what we need to do to get this camcorder up and running is we just add a new source and we will go to a video capture device. So okay, video capture device two, we'll call it. And we'll say, okay. Of course I call it, I named the other one that, so I'm gonna have to call it video capture three. I think I've deleted one. Well, I've deleted one. So video capture device three. That's just the name of it. We haven't got a one here. I don't know what I've done there. Anyway, so we get a USB video. Let's open up the camera. And there we are, job done. So now you can see this camera and you see the cat there, um, the other camera. So M50, Canon M50. The Sony camcorder. And of course this can be any camcorder with an HDMI output of course. And uh, job done, we've got the webcam going as well but that's hidden behind the screen. The screen coming from this video camera the Sony so that's about it so you're up and running you can either record your videos which is what I want to do or live stream and I will do some live streams later on once I get my head fully around it I've done a couple of live streams on my other channels um, just for sort of experimenting really I've got a couple of other channels one music channel which is like guitar guitars and music and uh, another channel main channel or not main well two main channels um, one with music and the other one is making moulds and casting with concrete and resin so that's one of them is Drama Mask Evolution but the name's going to change soon for that one and the uh, the music channel's Meme Run Music just in case you're interested and there'll be links in the descriptions of the videos and in, des in the description below as well so that's about it really so there we are, job done so there you can see the webcam Sony camera, Canon M50. There we are. I just moved the layer there. So now, so say like you can have obviously overlay your screens. So there we've got that. So if you were to play games, you obviously you could have your webcam in the corner. And if this could be the video game system or whatever you want to input into the computer, HDMI device. HDMI device or HDMI output into your computer and because uh, you see like online they were gamers they've got the screen they got the webcam or whatever well, you could use this as a webcam as well the Sony is a webcam now and eventually when I do videos into OBS I will be using the Canon, Canon M50 because obviously that's got the, the best picture out of these over these two cameras so there we are. So camcorder, HDMI cable, into your video capture card, cam link replica type of thing, or your, if you've got a um, Elgato cam link, then great, because they are the best on the market, apparently. And um, the USB lead, the obviously, well, you don't need the USB lead, you can just plug that straight into your USB socket. And I've just got a lead in this case, just as like an extension lead. So there we are, I hope that helps. Um, I'm gonna keep this video to remind myself. That's what I'm making these videos for really. So if I go a while without doing this, I can reference back and uh, see how it's done. So anyway, that's it for today. Thanks for watching and over and out for now.